This morning I uh, want to begin with a statement from Ernest Holmes. He says, see only what you wish to experience and look at nothing else. Cannot the great principle of life create for us all that we need? And is it not always thinking in terms of our good? The universe is inexhaustible, it is limitless, knows no bounds and no confines. We are relieved of all thought of clinging to anybody or anything. For we are not depending on a reed shaken by the wind, but upon the principle of life itself for all that we have or shall ever need. It is not some power or a great power. It is all power. These are the great realizations that free us completely. And let us know that as spiritual beings, we are never dependent upon person, place, or thing for our good. We definitely bless and love our particular sources as our current channels of good. Yet we recognize that within every particular source is actually the one source supplying us with love, money, happiness, and all. In addition, we recognize that no source is the sum total of our good, yet only a part of the whole of our good operating. In my father's house are many mansions. And what is it that eternally provides us with good? Spirit itself, that very sublime substance that brought us into being, follows up its creative action with supplying us and taking care of us. For we are in it, of it, and partake of its good. So know that whatever good you are now desirous of bringing into being, that that very essence of all life that thought of you and brought you forth as its beloved expression has also simultaneously thought of every expanded phase of your good and of ways and means of supplying beyond human knowing. This power always comes forth with your good as its perfect sustaining action. Channels may flux and change, grow and flow, but they are always God's choice and God in disguise. So don't be fooled by appearances. Have faith in all and recognize everything always works together for your greatest joy. Cultivate that faith which knows no opposites and it shall be done unto you as you believe. So let us go within now to that perfect center where all radiant life and the full presence of God is. Let us view our particular good from on high and see it completely unfolding wonderfully now. See ourselves accepting that good, fulfilled and rejoicing. See ourselves as God sees us, our lands infilled, our lives joyous, liberated and free. And let us say together within now, I am the way and the life. In me is the substance of all good and all fulfillment. I rest secure and free, knowing my oneness with all. And say with me now, I circulate and vibrate now. In the high, rich, providing atmosphere. 
of the substance of God, in whom I live and move and have my being. All my prayers are answered. All my prayers are answered. And all my days are blessed. And all my days are blessed. And so it is. And so it is.